366 Days with Wisdom by Venerable Master Xingyun. August 20th. Be grateful for past causes and conditions and treasure the present effect. Build present causes and conditions to nurture future effects. A big tree is well cared for as it can provide shade and shelter to pedestrians. A bridge is protected as it provides a walkway across the river. Treasuring the human body, are you able to benefit people like a big tree by the roadside or a bridge across a river? Once when a man who had divine sight saw a person hitting a corpse by the roadside. He went forward and asked, This person is dead. Why are you hitting him? The reply was, I'll tell you, this corpse was my previous life. While alive, he committed many crimes. He killed, robbed and raped. He made me fall and suffer in the hell realm. If I don't hit him, I really cannot get over my frustration and anger. The man with divine sight continued on his journey and soon he saw another person bowing and offering flowers to a corpse. He moved forward and asked, This person is dead. Why should you offer flowers and respect? The reply was, I'll tell you. This corpse is the body of my previous life. While alive, he was compassionate, benevolent and showed reverence to the Triple Gem. He was filial, doing charity work to benefit his family and community. Owing to him, I am now reborn in the Deva realm, enjoying heavenly wealth and happiness. To thank him, I am offering my reverence. The body and person have a most profound relationship not only in this life, it can affect many future lifetimes. How can we not treasure it? Read, reflect and act. Our body has a most profound relationship with us in this life. It can even affect our many future lifetimes and thus should be cherished. Please tune in same time tomorrow as we meet on air.